ever wonder what goes into making athletes the consistent high performers that they are? We caught up with High Performance Director of the Athletics Federation of India, Volker Herman, who talked to us about the mental and physical aspects of being an athlete and how it's imperative to optimize for every millisecond. Because oftentimes, it's only a few milliseconds that's the difference between a podium finish and no podium finish. Volker Herman, sir, could you tell us a bit about what exactly your role as High Performance Director entails? Yeah, my role is to develop a conducive infrastructure so that um, Indian athletes become more successful in the future. We have a lot of potential and we're trying to get some medals in the Olympic Games, especially in 2024 and 2028. And I, together with my colleagues and the coaches, we are trying to establish the necessary infrastructure for our future athletes to be successful at an international stage. And digging deeper into the phrase high performance, uh, what are some of the aspects uh, of uh, training, of nutrition that you're looking at? Personally, I feel we have a lot of very talented athletes in India, but right now they're not really able to make it to the world-class level, only very few of them, and that's something we definitely have to address. Um, I feel that we have to introduce like more modern training methods, especially with regards to strength training, but also technical aspects of training. And on the other hand, we also have to ensure that our athletes get proper food, get proper recovery mechanisms like um, physiotherapy, um, things like that. Yeah, that's what we're trying to introduce so that our athletes are able to perform better. I know in the media previously you have spoken uh, against the overuse of supplements uh, by athletes. Uh, any progress that we've seen in the recent past? Uh, have we seen more natural diets? Uh, yeah, our athletes are relying quite a lot on supplements and that's something we want to reduce in future. Um, there's nothing wrong with supplements if you use them in the right way. Yeah, But you should take as little as possible and as much as necessary. And um, we've realized that our athletes often, they, yeah, they don't really know what they're taking. They don't really know what the benefits. So our goal within the next season is to educate them in a bit better um, and to, to align the supplements or the supplementation with the training. And you talked about how we have immense potential immense talent in a country like India and you talked about a couple of improving points as well what are some of the other aspects uh, that uh, you can think of that we can work on immediately such that we see improved performance uh, in upcoming international as well as national events yeah, we are aiming for the Olympic Games in Tokyo, for example. Um, what we're doing right now, we're in a process to evaluate proper plans with our coaches so that every top athlete is covered, um, that they have a very decent program um, with different phases of preparation and competition. We're also trying to improve the quality of the local as well as international competitions because we have realized that some of our athletes are lacking in um, the exposure when it comes to like really world-class competitions. So with regards to next season, we are trying to cooperate with an um, athletes agency, for example, who is able to bring our athletes into the world-class competitions and Diamond League meetings in Europe or the United States, for example. And so we'll conclude proceedings on a slightly light-hearted note. Uh, so I'll put you on the spot right now. I lack a bit of performance at the gym. I work hard, but for some reason, you know, I'm not seeing the results that I that I'm hoping for. Based on a quick look, how exactly can I improve my performance and you know reach that high performance level? I mean, you, you, you look quite sporty, so there's nothing much to complain, but um, we have to have a deeper look and probably, uh, especially with regards to strength training, there are a lot of new training methods like eccentric strength training for some you might be able to introduce with yourself as well. Lovely. I'll definitely consult you on that. Thank you so much for joining us on One Play Sports. Cheers. It's been a pleasure. Thank you. Thank you.